Australia's property market has taken another big step down with our city leading the slump. Prices in Sydney dropped by 1.4% in just the last month, now with a 9.5% price decline since the top of the market, almost breaking an unwanted record. It's just shy of the biggest ever fall, which came right before a recession. So obviously coming to here, you've got the pool area. It's the start of summer but Sydney's property market is cooler than ever. The banks have really tightened their lending policies and we've found that's been the biggest delay we've experienced with buyers. New figures today show a dramatic drop in property values. Across Australia, prices fell 0.7% last month, led by Sydney, where the plunge was twice the national average. Since this time last year, Sydney values have fallen by just over 8%. The pace of declines has really accelerated. In Sydney, it was the largest monthly fall since May 1994. The downturn's so steep, it's now just 0.1% of a percent from being the worst on record. Last weekend's auction clearance rates of 41%, continuing this year's downward trend. I think it really highlights the level of confidence out there in the housing market at the moment and, and people are not particularly confident. Buyers and sellers are usually busy until around mid-December, when the holiday season puts a break on sales. But given such a weak November, experts don't see activity picking up until well into next year. The next couple of months is certainly going to be fairly slow going. Sellers hoping for a break in the price plunge may need to be ready for a longer game. I think anyone putting their property on the market right now understands what's happening. Gemma Acton, 7 News.